A major error leaves the Clearfield High School baseball team without a coach and without a home field. An attempt to dry the infield turned their field of dreams into an environmental nightmare. ABC4's Rick Aaron explains. A strong-armed pitcher is sometimes said to be throwing gas, but this was something completely different. A Clearfield High School baseball coach dousing the infield dirt with unleaded gasoline and diesel fuel and then setting it on fire. This eight-year-old YouTube video shows the kind of technique that head coach Steve Ross was allegedly attempting. Holy cow. Wow. <laughs> Wow. I'm not sure we're going to get away with that and clearing up. That's all I'm going to Talk about the hot corner. Ross reportedly poured 15 to 20 gallons of fuel over several different areas. A parent complained about a strong smell of petroleum during a game on March 23rd. And now Ross is on administrative leave while the Davis School District and the Davis County Health Department investigate. We're not concerned about the people who we're there or anything like that, but we are concerned about the, the product in the soil, you know, contaminating the soil and possibly penetrating further down. They're specifically worried that the fuel could seep into the groundwater, so the field will now have to be dug out. There was another test done on Monday to see just how far spread the um, contamination is and where we need to start removing the dirt. We'll go down a few inches, make sure that it's then clean, and if it's not clean, we go down a few more inches and then all of that will be replaced. The Falcons next scheduled game here is Wednesday, April the 10th against Northridge. That is if somebody can hit cleanup before that time. Reporting in Clearfield, Rick Aaron, ABC4 News. The school district says there is no estimate yet on how long the remediation work will take or how much it will eventually cost.